to another video it's your girl paul nicole if you're new here i would love it if you subscribe if you are returning hey girl hey so in today's video i'm thinking y'all christmas is literally days away um less than a week away so i need to like finish up some of my christmas shopping I've actually just been putting it off. I was supposed to go yesterday, but I start feeling under the weather. Um, so today I have to actually really get out there and hit it. Get all of my Christmas shopping wrapped up. I'm still actually trying to plan us a last minute like little Christmas trip. Nothing really big, but it's something just last minute we're trying to do with the kids. So I have to do that. And then I'm also going to have to get stuff... Um, to get us on our trip um to you know tie up anything that we need for our trip since it will be a christmas trip you know we're gonna have to do like some christmasy things and then me being the person that i'm being um you know that can consist of consist of coordinating outfits some kind of way certain christmas activities to do while we're on our trip just a whole bunch of stuff so it's super early i plan on going out by myself today which i'm so excited about this is like a self-care day in a way everybody's self-care looks different and my self-care is when i can go to the stores peacefully without my children i'm getting me an outfit i feel like putting some clothes on because y'all i have been like down like down some kind of little cold hit berkeley then it hit dallas then it hit me so it did me dirty okay i'm gonna i feel like actually putting some clothes because i just been feeling ugly <clears throat> i got this cute um outfit that i picked out it's just this really really oversized shirt it's super oversized on me it actually looks like a dress um I actually have never even worn it before because it's so, so oversized. Well, this particular one I have not worn yet. Luckily, I have several. Um, but this one I have not worn yet, but it's super, super oversized. So, I feel like I can actually wear it as a dress or just a really, really oversized shirt. Like, with some tights or biker shorts or something like that under it. Um, and then I just got this... Um, cardigan i mean not cardigan what kind of sweater is this it's not a cardigan just a sweater this is actually from j crew <clears throat> it's a man's sweater babe just ordered a whole bunch of stuff from j crew and i accidentally sent him that sweater um and so i was like i can fit it i'm thinking about maybe wearing these boots or at first i thought about just wearing my air force ones we'll see though we'll see it depends then i have a new dossier fragrance of the day as i'm always telling you guys the best accessory to a bomb outfit is a bomb fragrance so this is my new dossier fragrance that i'm sharing with you guys today dossier is the company that offers luxury inspired fragrances for a fraction of the price so some of your favorite designer perfumes or niche perfume they have mint fragrances women's fragrances unisex fragrances so this one is another one that i'm just through the roof about with dossier you are able to try your fragrance risk-free you can spray this bottle try it out if you don't like it you can still send it back and get your money back you have this amazing program where the more you buy the more you save so it's basically exactly what it sounds like you buy more you save more okay so let's get into this fragrance that i will be wearing today this is the fragrance oriental sage by dossier it is inspired by time for effing fabulous so last night y'all i tried this on if you are new here there are certain fragrances that i wear to bed this is going to be my fragrance of today. It is a unisex fragrance, so ladies, you can wear this fragrance. My men, y'all can wear this fragrance. Make sure you check out Dossier. Of course, I do have a great discount code for you guys. I will be sure to have all the information linked down in the description box, so check them out. And make sure you let me know if you have tried any Dossier fragrances and what are your favorites. Alrighty, so here's my outfit. This is how it came out. I'm a sweater, shirt, 
I put some tights on under here because this shirt is just so oh I just can't get with it really so um, I put some tights under and then I just actually kind of like tucked it here um and then I have on my forces smelling good feeling kind of cozy so I'm about to get in these streets okay so I'm here at Target and I am looking for Hot Wheels they had Hot Wheels for like 59 cents at the other Target like they were all out so I'm looking for Hot Wheels so I'm looking for like um a whole bunch of different cars or something as a gift. Look at this truck. This looks so cool. This one. That's pretty cool also. It says press bump. So that's cute. So I'm at Starbucks about to get me a medicine ball. I was trying to actually get one at the Starbucks inside of Target. They were super, super packed. Um, they had 15% off Starbucks drinks at Target. So, so I think I'm going to get a medicine ball because to try to help with my like congestion. Um, can I get a grande medicine ball? All right. And I just want to let you know we don't have the honey or agave. Uh, do you want to still get it without it? Uh, yeah, I mean, you can get it without it. Yeah. Can you put two pumps of peppermint in there also? Yeah, no problem. What size do you say? Grande. Okay, grande. No problem. What else is that for you? And then let me get an almond croissant. All right. And that's it. Perfect. I'll see you in the window. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Oh my gosh, I got all these flowers. My lace is lifting. Anywho, I am just leaving the Bucky's in Texas City. So for one of the gifts for someone I was planning on because they like like quirky things so they love hoodies and they love like quirky things so I was like okay what's what's better than um like Bucky's gear if you don't know what Bucky's is it's like this really big convenience store they have them I don't know if they were started in Texas, but they have them like in several states now. Oh my gosh, how do I get out of here? Like the store is literally humongous. I think they said the biggest one is in New Braunfels, maybe. The t-shirts are like a very big deal. Like it's it's a big deal. I went <clears throat> to go get some hoodies and some of the snacks. They have these things called beaver nuggets. It's like their signature something that they make or whatever and then my aunt is obsessed with their ch cherry sours so we're going to be going out of town and we're going to pass by another bucky's so i'm going to stop at that one to get a t-shirt because for every bucky store they have a t-shirt that'll say like in this case it's texas city so it'll say like bucky's texas city so for the store that we're gonna stop at on our way out of town. I'm gonna stop and I'm gonna go get a Bucky's t-shirt from that store as well. Um, <clears throat> since I couldn't find a hoodie to add to the Christmas gift. So I'm gonna give Bucky's a Bucky's themed Christmas bag, basically. All right, so back from the grocery store, on an errand. to buying this cereal fruity dino it's still six dollars six ninety eight I think no, this, not a this is a big old bag though Dallas eat the fruit loops in two days 
What are those? Pretty dynamites? Yeah, pretty dynamites. <laughs> so, oh man, they probably tear your mouth up. <laughs> Roof of your mouth just be raw. Tote up. Usual, got some HEB brand granola bars. Got some stuff because we're going to be baking some cookies today. I usually buy these pizza chips, but this um, is actually the Parmesan flavor. I usually just buy like the sea salt. So I had a coupon for those because I bought the, they had this artichoke dip that they were trying. They were sampling. So this is it. It's spinach artichoke dip with bacon. So good. Baby, we can try to put this on the grill. I got some. Um, crab ceviche, eggs. I am hoping, okay, so years and years and years ago, I used to come all the way to Houston and go to, dang, I can't even think of this, gro it was like this grocery store that sold Frenchy sausages. And I'm thinking that this is them. Like they sell these in HEB now. So I'm going to try these and I'm going to see because y'all, I used to literally, what is the name of that freaking grocery store? Foodorama, Foodorama. If you from Houston, then you know Foodorama. So Foodorama, they were literally one of the only grocery stores and maybe the only grocery store that used to sell Frenchie's Creole sausage. And I used to drive all the way from Cali Station to, um, to Foodorama and load up on those Frenchie sausages, y'all. So they stopped selling them. And I'm just so, I'm hoping that this is them, y'all. I'm hoping that this is them. And then I also got these um, chicken breasts that's stuffed with spinach. We have tried, like, um, they have, like, a stuffed chicken that's stuffed with, like, um, crawfish etouffee maybe and it's really really good but then uh, this is more stuff for bacon white chocolate chips some peppermint crunch we got coffee babe has his pike place this is a cake mix for baking saltines my children love just eating plain old saltines then I also got these I just want to try these crackers to go with my um, ceviche and of course, if I'm buying coffee, I could not buy anything other than my Houston Blend Cafe Ole. Then I got these HEB brand Oreos. They were free when I bought my coffee. We have some pink lady apples. We have some breakfast croissants, Jimmy Dean. And then I bought a tub of potato salad because I'm actually pop oh yeah probably we're probably gonna eat steak so I'm gonna put these marinate them for a little bit and then probably put them on the grill um this was these are just some um ribeye steaks so three pack I think this is a really good deal it was only 18 dollars for these big steaks so that's everything that I got from HEB. Let me show you guys what I got from Target. I showed you guys that I was looking for um, some type of car or truck for a Christmas gift. And I decided on this one. It was actually on sale. And you press the bumper and it like lights up and does all this stuff. I don't know what else it does, but it looks really cool. Um... The person that I bought that for, he has so, so many like cars and trucks or whatever. So I'm like, I just want to get something different. So I'm hoping he does not have the Fortnite mud flap. From Bucky's, I got us these Christmas shirts. I was telling you guys about like shirts from Bucky's or whatever. So these are the shirts I got us for Christmas. It has the beaver and then on the back, it says never calm, always bright. So cute. So I got all of us matching ones. Hey, dang, this is an extra large. 
Dang, this looks big. I gotta get extra large because I like my shirts to fit the color size. But that looks big. Then, this is one that I got as a gift for someone. These are the ones I was telling you that shows like the city of the Bucky store. So this one is from Texas City. <clears throat> so it's just lime green. And then <clears throat> these are all of ours. So Dallas is babes. Circles. Make sure I got the right sizes in these because they were really in there like Picking over those sizes. This one lady said that she had been to several different Bucky's trying to find all of the sizes she needed so all of her family could have these coordinating shirts for Christmas. So they have these Bucky mat face masks as well. Look at that. So I got two adult ones and two child ones. So this will be our gift. Then I just got this extra one for Dallas. And these are the Beaver Nuggets that I was telling you about from Bucky. And then the Cherry Sours from Bucky. I also want to show you guys what I got. This is from um, Target. I forgot to show you guys. I got this cute little dress for Mama. It's Cat and Jack, of course. It's so cute, y'all. And it actually has pockets. I cannot, but they had several different colors. Super cute. It was only $12. And then I also bought her some Cat and Jack snow boots, y'all. These are so cute. These were only, how much were these? I think these were, oh, <clears throat> these were $20. So they were $19.99. So yeah, I got mine with that. So that's basically what I got today. So it is dinner time. And for my cheerings, I'm not cooking no dinner. I'm about to heat up corn dogs. I'm gonna have some corn dogs. And then Berkeley will be having some sweet potato bites with hers. And Dallas will have some french fries. I have these thawing out for me and babe. I'm gonna show you guys. Okay, now look at my margarita glasses. How cute are these, y'all? And I got these from- Yeah, those are like weed. <laughs> I got these from Dollar Tree. So these were a dollar 25, I think. Um, so yeah, I got a set of four of these. They're really, really thick, good quality. But I plan on just putting my frozen margaritas in here or even like just um, on the rocks. But those are super cute. And then I also bought, I'm trying to show you guys my Dollar Tree finds. Uh, oh, these bowls. These came from Dollar Tree as well. So I bought a set of four. Um, that was 25 so they look so so cute and yeah they're just some glass balls you know I do not want colored dishware um so yeah I got these just wanted to show you guys though throw it to me Right. Okay, boom, boom. Or is it? <laughs> Whoa. Ooh. No. Ooh. Okay, I'm trying to teach you to it. So, so I'm gonna go slow mo again. I can't do it if we gotta do side okay. beside me. Okay. Hold on, that's not slow. Okay. But, but, boom, boom. But if you're starting, you want to have your right arm like this. Oh, so this got to, why do I keep doing this? I don't okay, know. Okay, so. No, no, like this. this one is going to be down here. This, and like this. Mm -hmm. So, so it doesn't matter how you put the left arm right now, but it just has to be down. So I, so I can do it normally like this. And then boop, boop, boop. Okay, better.
make the cookies. Um, basically, I'm going to start by putting a white cake mix. Two eggs. We're going to be using ginger ale. It says how much soda? A third a cup of soda. Food coloring. That's optional. So I think I want to make green cookies. Fold in the red and green M and M's and white chocolate chips. So, I don't have that many red and green M&M's because just finding red and green M&M's is so impossible. I couldn't even find just the plain M&M's, um, like in a big bag. They were all sold out. So, we just have these. These were in our little elf thing. We had two, but I ate one already before I decided I was going to make these cookies. So, I'm just going to put that like that. And then, we're going to do... We're supposed to do a lot of M&M's actually, but we don't have that many. So it says half a cup of white chocolate chips. Here are the cookies. Here they are. Let's see. Cake cookies, everyone. <laughs> they are good. Good one? Very fluffy. Mm. I'm kind of scared, though. Why? Cause, cause, cause it looks like a gorilla's tongue when, whenever they eat a hundred thousand leaves in one day, and, and their tongue got bit by the stump. And look at the inside. Hmm. I, I, I didn't really get a taste. <laughs> That's pretty good. We should have made this for Grinch Day. Mm-hmm. 